a king once thought that he would never fail if he knew three things one what the right time was to begin something two which people he should take advice from three how to decide what the most important thing to do was he sent messengers throughout his kingdom he promised to give a reward of a large sum to the person who answered his three questions many wise men tried their luck they gave a number of answers one said that the king should go by a time table another said that the king should do whatever seemed to him necessary at the moment the third suggested that the king should consult wise men or magicians answering the second question they gave top importance to his counselors or to the priest or to doctors or to soldiers in reply to the third question the wise men gave importance to signs or fighting or religious worship the king was not satisfied he went to a hermit in the jungle alone there he saw the old and weak hermit digging the ground the king asked his questions but got no answer then he took the spade from the hermit and began to work in his place several hours passed it was evening so the king stopped digging the beds the king was ready to take leave from the hermit just then the hermit told that someone was running towards them his hands were pressed against his stomach from which blood was oozing as he reached the king he fainted and fell to the ground he had a large wound in his stomach the king washed the wound and compressed it with his handkerchief at last the bleeding stopped the man felt better and asked for water to drink the king gave him fresh water the sun had set by then the king and the hermit carried the wounded man into the hut and laid him on the bed the tired king also fell asleep when he awoke the bearded man asked to forgive him the man was in fact the king's enemy he had followed the king to take revenge on him he had vowed to kill him the king had once put his brother to death the man hid himself in a bush on the way to the jungle he came out of his hiding place when the king did not return for long he got wounded by the king's bodyguards he would have died if the king had not dressed his wound he felt grateful to the king who had saved his life he promised to serve the king as a faithful servant the king was happy that he had made peace with his enemy he forgave the man and promised to give back his property the king then went up to the hermit he again asked for answer to his three questions answer to his three questions the hermit explained that by digging the beds for him the king had escaped the attack so the most important time was when he was digging the beds the hermit himself was the most important person so to do him good was the king's most important business the hermit further told the king that the most important person for him was the person with him at a particular moment the most important business was to help that person and the most important time was now that is the present moment so enjoy your present moment